Hey kids, I hear you're getting bullied in school. Well, don't worry. And I'm here to tell you that it gets better. I won't lie to you. Some things about growing up aren't so great. Like when your hair starts falling out and you have to be embarrassed about your hairline and it's a little bit harder to control your weight. But other than that, it gets better. Oh, and there is the fact that once you reach voting eligibility, you realize that all of the bullies that picked on you in school have also all reached voting eligibility. And guess what they're voting for? They're voting to continue oppressing you, essentially bullying you uh, from the comfort of the voting booth. That's always wonderful, right? But hey, it gets better. And. Then there's the problem of the fact that these people, these bullies who continuously picked on you, are having children of their own at a much faster rate than you because they're stupid and don't understand how to protect themselves from having too many kids. So they have like a flock of like 20 kids for your one kid. And guess what values they're teaching those 20 kids, if they're teaching them values at all? They're teaching them the same values that led them to bully you in the first place. So when your kid goes to public school, he's going to get bullied by their kids. And you'll have to sit them down and say, don't worry, it gets better. Because if you don't feed them that line of bullshit, then you're worried they're probably going to fucking kill themselves. And the same aggressive tendencies that led those bullies to ostracize and demean you in the first place are actually probably going to lead some of them to lucrative careers. Because in the corporate world, aggression is important. It's more important than intelligence. So hey, some of your bullies are actually going to achieve positions of power. Isn't that a comforting thought? But hey, it gets better. And you know the daydreams that you escape into now of making some Something great of yourself? Well, so many people are going to tell you that those dreams are impractical that you'll start to believe it. And you'll settle for something less. And you, everything that you wanted to be, everything that you thought you would be, everything that you that you thought you would pursue in life, it all gets set by the wayside while you focus on the minutia of just feeding and clothing yourself. All because you never developed the self-confidence that was necessary for your success because everyone around you was always putting you down because they're a bunch of hyper-aggressive macho assholes. But hey... It... It... It, it doesn't get better. What the fuck are we talking about? What, why do we have to feed this lie to ourselves? Why do we have to say it gets better when we know goddamn well that no, it really doesn't get better. We just get more callous to it. We just look at the same assholes doing the same shit they always did to us, but on a grander scale with greater social consequences, and we just have to fucking put it out of our minds and act like it's not there. And meanwhile, that fucking picked on kid is, is still inside of us, just fucking crying, because those assholes are now in control, and they still outnumber us, and they're still picking on us. It doesn't get better. If you gotta live a lie, 